What up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I thought I'd make a video on how to do some manuals. You know, ollie up onto a manual pad and manual. This is a great beginner trick. You know, you should learn how to manual on the ground first. So you can at least, you know, when you get up on the manual pad, you know, you can, you know, you're going to be able to manual across the manual pad, but great beginner trick. I'm going to do a couple and then we're going to talk about it. It was always easier for me to manual if I was manually across a longer manual pad for some reason. I don't know why. That's just me. The wind is whipping. I can hit rocks and stuff. Dude, I should have put my dragon wheels on. Who, drive, who out there rides dragon wheels? I noticed when I was skating dragon wheels all the time, they're like, I would barely even hit any rocks. I'm skating the Bones X Formula, which are still pretty good, but I noticed I hit a lot more rocks. Get caught up. One more manual and then we'll talk about it. perfect the balance on the two wheels um get your ollies down where you can ollie you know pretty effortlessly up onto like a curb right here like this and uh i find that it's a uh, it's good practice to ollie and try to stay on your back wheels kind of like that you kind of get the feeling of like what it's going to feel like to ollie up onto this curb and land on your back wheels but you know, foot placement, you know, foot placement right in the pocket right here is the best, you know, balance spot. So it's basically, you know, right in this zone. It can be with your back foot on the back two bolts, or it can be a little bit back farther. You don't want to have it back here. It's just going to be hard. It's going to be hard to hold it right like that. But if you can get it in this zone right here, you know, see, like that, about right in there, that's a good balance spot for a manual. You know, when you're practicing them on the ground, you'll see when you start to get them, this is a good spot to get that leverage. Now you want to ollie up. You want to ollie. You want to ollie up kind of quick, kind of floaty pop, kind of like. A, and you want to stay like this because you want those back wheels to be the first thing that hits the manual pad up here. Front foot placement, whatever feels comfortable. Now for your ollie, whatever feels comfortable to you to ollie up there, you know, you can put your foot in the middle or you some people put their, like to have their foot up right under the, right under the uh, bottom bolts with the front. You know, wherever it's comfortable for you to ollie. Front foot doesn't really matter too much. You obviously don't want to have it too far down. And you obviously, when you land up there, you don't want to have it too far down. So when you land up there, you kind of want to have your foot. You know, when you slide up, you kind of want to stop. Kind of want to have your foot go over the front bolts right there. And you just ollie up. Get a quick, quick floaty pop. Land on those back wheels. As soon as you feel those back wheels touch, you want to try to hold it there. You know? So, um, you just manual across. You can do it on, like, shorter manual pads. You don't have to start it on a long manual pad like this. Um, but the, the faster you go, the easier it is going to be to balance across this thing. If you go slower, then you're going to really have to try to balance so keep that in mind i know you don't want to go fast right off the rip um, you kind of want to get comfortable with it first first you want to learn the manual on the ground flat ground try to get long ones go as far as long as you can go you know super long just try to perfect the balance you know you got your ollies up to par to getting on a curb 
pretty comfortably. And then you just want to practice. Practice, try to land on those back wheels and get up on the curb and get up on the manual pad and, and try to balance those manuals across there. It's not an easy trick, you know, for those beginners. But you can do it pretty consistently once you get it down. One of the funnest tricks to do on a skateboard feels fun. It's just fun. There's not really too much scariness to, scariness to it. It's just, it's just fun. But um, anyway, that's pretty much it on the manuals. If you like the content, please subscribe. Hit the like button. Um, leave a comment. Uh, can you do manuals already? You know, you already got them down. You struggle with them. What, what, what do you struggle with? Leave me a comment. I'll comment back. Share the video. If you know somebody that struggles with manuals, they would benefit from watching this video. Share the video. Anyway, guys, peace.